away guys it don't happen again there is another lady that just come out for your edoche and do the austin this lady is a prophetess she just sent a strong message to Judy Austin and Joe Edoche, this lady, which is this prophetess, make us to understand that Joe Edoche is under a spear, guys. Guys, please pardon my manners. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, my Ogbonge fans. Depends of the location you see my video from. My name, Remain Quilati TV. Guys, please do me a favor to share my video, follow this page, and comment under the section of this video, guys. My name, Remain Quilati TV. Guys, let me leave you here to see this strong message that this lady, this which is this prophet has sent to Judy Austin. I will see you for the next video, guys. Bye bye, guys. See you. Disturbance everywhere. I'm making this video just to, you know, to let my followers rest. A lot of a lot of them has been chatting me, telling me, uh, "Mommy, you have not said anything concerning the." Um, yo, Edochie, his first wife and uh, the concubine. He haven't said anything. We have been expecting you to say something to, you know, on air. But, you know, my work is to preach, to prophesy, to pray for people. It's not, um, it's not so that uh, marriage uh, scandal is a problem. But looking at the whole thing, uh, God Almighty, is with me, Edochi. Yes. Mm -hmm. Yes, like I was saying, God Almighty is with that young lady. Yes. In the next world, I don't think there will be marriage. I don't think that God will allow marriage again. Marriage has ruined heaven. Marriage has destroyed the plans and the purpose of God. Concerning man, humanity. Yes. I have been watching, I have been waiting to hear what you, Edoche, said that May did to him. I haven't heard that. Yes. Everybody is complaining, saying many things. I have been waiting to hear on air from you, Edoche, that May, his wife, followed another man. Or may his wife tried to poison him. Or may his wife stole his money. I have not heard anything. Yes. I didn't, I didn't hear anything. And I have seen the whole thing that uh, you, a dochie, is under spell. And before somebody can be captured by the spell, you put in, the spell will see your interest. Before any woman can capture you as a man with a charm or whatever, interest must show you, must show interest. You might have shown interest to that person. Yes. Anyways, sometimes it's not all about marriage. It is all about destiny. It is all about what destiny. The time for men's destiny to shine has come. And it is something that marriage cannot stop. Uh, you Edoche has been caging the woman, hiding the woman, you know, pressing the woman, putting her inside the house, which is this kind of destiny she carries. But time of God, nobody can stop it. Yes. When time to bless you comes, when time for star, your destiny to shine comes, marriage cannot stop it. Except you don't know whom you are, except you are nobody. You don't know the person you are, you are the species you made of. Before anything on earth can stop you, children can't stop you, husband can't stop you, wife can't stop you. When time for your star to shine, for your destiny to shine comes, anything can happen. Anything can happen. And I want to tell all the women, all the ladies that are, you know, entering into some people's marriage, you are cheap. Any lady that is interested in married man is a cheap lady. You are cheap. Yes, you are very cheap. You don't worth anything. You don't know whom you are. You are happy to marry somebody's husband. You are cheap. You are cheap. Yes, you don't, yes, you don't have destiny. Yes. As a young lady, 
as a young lady, you accept to be a second wife, third wife. You are cheap. Mm -hmm. You are cheaper. Yes, a good lady with with goals, with destiny, will never stoop so low to be a second wife. Yes, it's not, it's not about love. It is wickedness. You are cheap and you are wicked. Yes, it is better as a married woman that left the husband or something happened where you, the husband chased you away, divorce you. You look, marry a single man, single man. Don't be a second wife. If you know whom you are, you know your worth, you will not marry a, a, a married man. Marry a single man. Yes. I am not a... I am not against a, 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 a Judy Austin marrying, remarrying and remarrying and remarrying. But I am against her remarrying to someone's husband. Mm -hmm. If you think you are beautiful, if you think you are okay, you carry something, you are this and that, why not attract a single man? Let single man marry you. Not a married man. If you marry a married man, you are cheap. You are worthless. Yes. In the, uh, in the other way, uh, may, may rejoice. God has remembered you. And don't think anything concerning that man. That man is bygone. That man, so long he violated he, the law between you and him in that marriage, that man is not your man. Yes. God take you away from him because of your star. And I want to appreciate all the people that uh, has been by my side, uh, supporting me, you know, giving her life, giving her life a meaning, making her to feel that, yes, yeah, she is loved without that so-called husband, that she is loved. God bless you all. And the things of peace will never cease in your families. AY, God bless you and your marriage and your family. In the name of Jesus, may rejoice, rejoice the end we tell. The end we tell. As for Judy Austin, clap yourself. For marrying a married man, you are cheap. Yes. With your beauty and elegancy and all, oh, you are cheap by marrying a married man. Yes. Uh, may I pray for you. God be with you. More open doors, more connection, more blessings in the name of Jesus Christ. And what I want to add again is any married man that looked at his wife and you can't handle your home. All these problems everywhere is just it's because of pride. And you can't stand on the vow with your wife. You attach your marriage with another woman. You don't want to marry that woman again. You don't want to be a husband. Yes, you don't want to be a husband. Yes, women, stop dying because of men. Stop dying because of men. They don't like you. They push you away. They violate the law between two of you. Go ahead. Go move forward and pursue your goal. Forget about him. Forget about him. He is a human. You have something. You carry something. It might only take time, but you fulfill it. Don't cry. Don't die of depression. And what I want to add again is any married man that looked at his wife and you can't handle your home. All these problems everywhere is just it's because of pride. And you can't stand on the vow with your wife. You attach your marriage with another woman. You don't want to marry that woman again. You don't want to be a husband. Yes, you don't want to be a husband. Yes, women, stop dying because of men. Stop dying because of men. They don't like you. They push you away. They violate the law between two of you. Go ahead. Go move forward and pursue your goal. Forget about him. Forget about him. He is all human. You have something. You carry something. It might only take time, but you will feel it. Don't cry. Don't die of depression.